have only been offered since the middle of October and for a small percentage of students. LEX 18's Claire Kopsky joins us now with more in this coronavirus coverage. Claire and Chris, good morning. The Fayette County School District is citing the possibility of further spread of COVID-19 over the Thanksgiving holiday as a reason that targeted services will be coming to a close one week from today. It's been an uncertain year for Fayette County students as a plan for moving students back into the classroom took months for the district to compile. And some families still say they are dissatisfied with the lack of options, including the lack of an in-person option for the wider student base. On October 19th, the district did begin to offer targeted services for a few thousand students in which they went inside their school building for a couple of hours a week to meet with teachers in person. During that time, the district says there have been a few COVID cases among students and teachers, but those cases were isolated and not transmitted in any school buildings, instead contracted outside of school. With COVID-19 cases climbing and Thanksgiving break approaching, district officials say that they thought it would be best to put a stop to the program. However, looking ahead to January, the district says that they do plan to have students back on campus if their family selected in-person instruction in a survey issued earlier this fall. Those who selected remote instruction will continue to learn virtually. But the district says if the county is in the red zone as January approaches, the semester will begin online. The letter from the district says that if the county is in the green, yellow or orange zones when it comes to COVID-19 cases, that they will offer an in-person option for more students than just targeted learning students. This offering a glimmer of hope for some families who have been desperate for an in-person option. Claire and Chris, back to you.